This is rare. It's unmarked Pyrex. It's unmarked Pyrex. Ugh, oh my gosh, look, look. Welcome back to the channel. And this morning we are estate sale shopping once again in central Florida and I'm really excited. Let's go. All right, we first walked in here. There's this beautiful little bell here and it is Balik, which I love picking up Balik whenever I can. So for $2, I'm going to get this little guy. Oh, I like this art here. Look at this, $3. I, is it? It's really pretty actually. I'm trying to see if it's painted or, I think it's printed. Yeah, maybe I won't on that one, but I, I I will get the bell. That's that's a good looking Balik bell. The kit or the bathroom is here, which I'm not even sure why I walked into that because that's not what I want right now. There's this over here. Oh look, isn't that cool? A little plane for three dollars. This clock, china case, I'm like a neat gift. I'll pick that up. Ooh, here in the bedroom they have lots of little fun things. So, what do we see? Well, there's some nice art glass. 13 though, can't do it. 13 on that one, no. These little glass guys are fun. They're a dollar each, I'm wondering about them. Let me look at them. Are they, I haven't, oh wait, there we go. Oh, Avon, okay. They're a dollar each, very very affordable. There's a little kitten there. Is this all cats? Oh yes, there's a set of three. You know what? Um, I'm going to buy the set of three. I think those are really fun together. And then there's also these brass squirrels. Those are kind of cool. I'll just look those over here. What is this out though? Just a little thing. Okay. There's a, there, these are Gobel or maybe they're, these are the J Japanese version. They are the Gobel version. Six dollars on those on the Hummels. Okay, so yeah, I'll get these and the three cats from this table, but I think that's about it on this table. I think so. Okay, I just found another in the bathroom here. Uh, five dollars, and um, it's pretty cool, you know, it's very 70s, so. I'll pick that up and add it to my pile and it, you know, it's working. So that's cool. It's just, it's just interesting. Estate sale number two this morning and we are headed into this next, oh, they've got solar panels up on their roof. Wow, that is nice. Okay, so hopefully we can find some interesting things in here. Look at these little box shrubs over here. Aren't they neat? They're very randomly spaced, but they're well curated. I mean, oh, and this one, it's abstract more so. Okay, this looks nice. I like this furniture here, 55. Okay, look at that. They've got the pixie wear here. That is neat for 50. These little guys here for 10. Cracker guy. Lots of clear glass. All of these, not so much. Okay, they've got, oh, they have some jewelry. Let's see if there's, if there's any that we want. I like to get jewelry when I can, just based off of appearance, style. But, yeah, there's a butt here. I don't want any of this, I don't think. Darn. I mean, I probably missed some interesting things. What is this, a ring? That looks like one of those like gangster things where you would like punch somebody with it. <laughs> <laughs> it would hurt. Oh, wait a second now. We've got a Santa Claus here. What is this? Oh, muse? Wait, I'm a musical. He's a musical. Oh, he's missing his pom-pom on his head. That's neat. Broadway toy for 20. And then this is an Anna Lee here for eight. I like picking up the Anna Lee's when I can. What year is this one? 2012. Yeah, the chenille suit is in really good shape. For eight, I will get this little guy. I think it's fun, so uh, I will do that. Warning, this house is protected by an attack cat for $10. My, oh my, oh, there's the attack cat. Oh my gosh, I'm so afraid. Oh great, oh, there's some more attack cats. 
Yeah, let's put that on your front door and scare everyone. <laughs> oh my goodness. What is this, the entrance to Disneyland? Okay. Let's go over here. Thank you. Okay, so this is the office here. So far I've got a little Anna Lee and that's about it. Hmm. Let's check out this room. Looks like the main bedroom. Maybe. All right, so they have got lots of cards. Little vase. It's nice, made in Taiwan, $3 and $2. Hmm. No. They have a lot of this Egyptian artwork, $15 each on them. I don't know what that's made out of. Is it like a, a banana leaf or something? It's it's nicely done. Yeah. Oh, I like this gal. Look at that. She's doing yoga. That's really nice. Good yoga. Oh, now that's a stretch we all want to attain to. Look at that. What is this downward cat? Is that the pose? You see her? She's all around the whole town. They're all working underneath her. All right, let's head on into the rest of the house here. It's an interesting. Uh, I like the way they. I like the way that this room is arranged with the door like this. Okay, We've got a bedroom, closet. Thank you. Clothing. I don't want clothing. I'm not a fan of it personally. We could just do without. And <laughs> and then um, some pads. What do we have? I still have my little fun guy. Hmm. Some artwork. Oh, another closet. More clothes. Wow. Okay then, everybody. This is really cool, and I don't think I've ever seen it before, but it's $12. It has little blue diamonds on it. You know what I'm going to do? Something I don't normally do. I'm going to research this before I buy it. Because at $12, I'm a little on the edge, and shipping a bowl like this is not so exciting necessarily, but I love this bowl. I don't see any markings on it. So I'm going to check it out. It does... Now, to me, this does look older. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say that much, but I don't know who did it, because they didn't mark it. I'll let you know. <laughs> okay, I'm geeking out right now. There is a recent sold, sold of this bowl for $450. Yeah, I looked up the price history that it sold for. There's one below that for like in the 300s. So, I mean, of course it depends on condition, but this is rare. It's unmarked Pyrex. It's unmarked Pyrex. That's why I picked it up because it looks like the old Pyrex. It has the, the form and everything. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna quietly whisper this and take it. I'm buying it. Yep, yep, yep. See, it's very, very rare to find any deal like that. And it's always a special time when you can. And I'm just like, what? What? It's neat. Oh, 150 and it's sold. That's really cool. And there's this rocking chair here for it sold for 65. That's pretty cool. I think they sell for about a hundred or something like that at Walmart. I bought a couple of them uh, a few years ago. Oh wow. Okay. Got the kitchen here. Let's see here what we can accomplish. So they got uh, lots of little teacups and things. Some mashers, some depression glass, and these nice little plates, $2 each. Those are fun for those. These are Fenton. But let's look at the tops here. The tops have seen, you know, they've... They could be better, but they are marked Fenton. There we go. It's, it's showing now. So it's Fenton. Let's see what they have on this, though. I don't see 
Well, there's not a price on it, but it can't be that much. So we'll see. But um, these are nice. These are the hobnail. I think I want anything over here for resale. And there's also some fabrics and things over here. Oh, a little swan of swimming. It's a Christmas swan. Okay. Yeah, I don't I don't think any of this is good. Oh, I'm just remember my bowl. Wasn't that wasn't that a great bowl? Remember that? Such a good thing. Oh, that last sale. So nice. Oh, you know, this is a very nice table over here. That's stunning. That's beautiful. Only $285. That is actually very good. Isn't that stunning? You know what this reminds me of, strangely, is the Brady Bunch. Um, what was it called? A Very Brady Christmas. And they all came back, you know, many years later, back to the Brady house. And everything's changed. Like, all the mid-century stuff's gone. And it's, like, very much like this. Like, 90s Florida. So, uh, it oh, reminds me of this for some reason. But, 285 Wow. That's... It's really great. Oh, look at this console table. 85. See, that's nice as well. That's, that's great. It has two drawers. Hmm. They have some art glass here. Uh, it's a little bit on the newer side, made in China. So there's that. Here's a mid-century planter for five. It's mid-century, but it's kind of just... It is what it is, you know. It's kind of it's, it's kind of um, maybe like a Chinese style, Chinese modern with the gold. But uh oh, the pantyhose isn't marked. Oh, look at this! This is cool. One sixty-five for the two-person love seat. Generally, you need two people for a love seat, unless you are really into yourself. I always like looking at these real estate flyers. So this one is four hundred and forty-five thousand dollars they marked it down from four five nine it is a gardenia style three bedroom two bath beautiful that's what we're in right now new hvac enclosed lanai white cabinetry split floor plan and furniture available oh my look at all them words that's where we are the little the little push pan there okay we are headed into this fun estate sale and i say fun because it is full of flamingos now I don't know. There's a couple of flamingos that I saw in the preview photos that I was kind of interested in. I don't know if they're still here, but uh, one of them's a planter, depending on the price, and maybe some little ceramic things. But we are day. here, and we are going to find out soon. Let's, let's go to the flamingo department. Oh, here we are. Oh, my gosh. Look at all these. Wow. Yeah, I think the planter is gone. They've got a lot of little doodads here. Amazing. Mm. Oh my gosh. A lot of resin ones. Wow. This is really cool. Got a chalkware wall plaque for three. That's nice. Look at this flower frog. Oh, the frame's on the This is very good. I'm gonna get this for three dollars. It's a flamingo flower frog. This is really unique. I'm, I'm just getting the unique things if I can help it. This is a postcard. That's pretty. I have to look at that. It's like a rainbow, a rainbow flamingo parade. What are they doing? That's cool. Photography artist. It's very neat, actually. Very pop art. Hmm. Oh my gosh, flamingo toilet paper. You're kidding. What would I do with such a thing? Once you use it, it's gone. Wow. Oh my gosh, all these ornaments and everything. Oh my gosh. What in the world? Look at this cute little thing. I've not seen this one before. It's made in the Philippines of all places. Wow. 
this is a craft hobbyist piece, but this one I'd get for two dollars or for three. That's pretty cool. That's nice. This little wallet purse thing crafted. There's wall plates. Oh, that's this is what is this now? Not for food use. This this is a cool coaster. The flamingo coaster. That's neat. I kind of want that too. Oh my gosh. I'm getting more things than I planned on. This is ridiculous. Wow, this is a really great sale. They have a ton of stuff, including all of this jewelry. Oh my. It's taking everything in me not to go look at the flamingo stuff more. I just dropped off the items, but like that whole room, look at that. Full of flamingo stuff. It's just, it's just amazing. But yet, here I am. I'm just going to check one more time. So, let's look. It's because there's like lots of little things here. Like, this is glass. I mean, in like, I don't ever see glass flamingo stuff like this. For a dollar, it's like spun, spun glass. I'll pick it up. It's spun glass. That's resin. Ceramic. Some snow globes. The neck's been broken on that guy. Mm. So sad. Do I want any of these? A lot of them are bean sprouts. What in the world? A lot of them are on the newer side. Uh, this one looks maybe a little... I don't know. I can't see a date on that one. Kelly Toy. I need to stop. This is just... Oh, look at this little sign. It's made to look old. Six bucks made in China. It's so adorable. It's like a souvenir from, I guess, the Flamingo Hotel in Las Vegas. That's cool. Six dollars. If it was three, I probably would just pick it up, but... Oh, wow, there's a flamingo stamp. That's neat. A hook. All right, I should be done in here. I need to go make, I need to go find things to sell. That's what I need to do. Now we're in the living room, and I just noticed this little bell here for $2. It looks like Fenton, but I don't know. It's not marked. I think it's Fenton. I don't really buy many bells. Are you Fenton? I think so. I think I'm going to pick it up for two bucks because that's really a, a great deal anyway. But they've got flamingo office supplies too. Oh my gosh. There is a lot of stuff here. Wow. Look at this. This looks very Italian maybe or like Portugal or something. That flamingo, amazing. Ladder shelves. There is some great stuff here. Amazing. What is this? Oh, we got cameras. Even more plushes. Rust. Now that's an older one. Lavender. Laverne? Laverne. Oh, look at her with her eyelashes. I'm being good. I have enough of those. I have a whole collection of little stuffed plushes of the flamingos, so I'm trying not to, for sure. Oh my, oops, my little bell's dinging around. Look at all these pillows in here. Wow, how did they sleep with so many pillows? Can't imagine. What is this? Oh, look at all these little doodads in here. Mm. Wow, wow, wow. This is one busy house with uh, with stuff. <gasps> Look at all these little flamingos. There's chimes. Oh, my. Oh, my goodness gracious. Now, that one is cool with the glass intertwined through it. That's kind of different. Oh, I need some more. No, those are kind of rusty. I was going to say, I need some of those, but those are a little bit rustier than I prefer. Oh, they have a flamingo bird bath. Now that is cool. And another one there. Oh, no, I want a flamingo bird bath. 65. Look, and it even has reliefs of flamingos on it. Oh, my. When was this made? There's like a 
copyright thing at the bottom of it. There's this one too. This one's easy. Ow. This one's easier to read. It says distinctive stone something. I think it says distinctive stone. This one is missing color, but it might be in might be in better might be in better shape even. Hmm. Uh, but he said, can you send me a picture so I <gasps> the brick? There's a concrete one over there, too. That one's 65. That's a nice one. Wow. Oh my gosh, we're in the garage now. And I, I'm going to fall over. This is a glass Christmas ornament for like a um, dollar. So, do I need this? I can resell it. That's okay. I'll resell it. But they've got like all of these. I'm just like... I can't. Oh my gosh, look. Look. It's ridiculous. <laughs> it's like so much. Oh my gosh. All the Tupperware, even. Wow. All right, so I picked up these items from a mixture of in the garage and in the kitchen. And I forgot to film as I was picking them up, but I thought I'd show them. This one is $5 from the Animal Kingdom. So I'll decide if I want to keep this one or sell it. I, I like the size and the quality of it specifically and then I found a couple mugs for I think myself this one very like 90s looking so I got this one for 50 cents I found more of the coasters so those go with the other wooden ones and then there's my little ornament from the, the thing look at this isn't that cute this is portobello by design for a dollar and I actually have a Halloween one that's flamingos that a subscriber sent me. So now I have the regular flamingo. So I'm really happy about that. And I will continue looking because there is so much to see and I'm gonna look more at the jewelry as well. So hopefully we find some more, maybe non-flamingo things. <laughs> so I'm back in the flamingo room and they have $5 on this little guy. And so I'm gonna get it. It's art glass, stunning in the box. Also, I didn't mention this, but I've had this very piece before. This is made by Porcelier. It's old. It's pretty old. And it's marked there. Porcelier was known for fixtures, like uh, porcelain ceramic light fixtures. So, but they did a few teapots, and this one is of the, the flamingos, the flamingo pattern. Okay. So, I'll get the glass in my hand. That's good. I'll add that to the pile. Oh, this is nice too. This night light for three. Ugh, I just can't stop. Darn it. Isn't that adorable? Oh, you're so adorable. That could go in my bathroom. Well, this thing. Eh, it's okay. Never mind. I don't need it. It's okay. We're good. Oh, look. The little pill box. Oh, what's inside? Oh. Yep, yeah, I'm getting that. That's adorable. Oh, actually, I think this is old. Unless this is the reproduction from the 80s. You see, those are great little shakers though. The cold paint, yeah, I think these are the newer ones, I think, because it's based on an old one. The cold paint green is flopping off, so. Mm. That's cute, made of wood as well. The flamingo hatching. Mm -hmm. Right, that was really great. Now I had to show so much restraint with those darn flamingos, but I did end up getting quite a few. But overall, this was a great morning estate sale shopping. And with that, I will wrap up this video. So thanks for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.